Officer. Yes, sir. Why are you covering up your plate? Oh, this is what I do is I'm hot. Oh, I understand. I had to wear one of those one time. Yeah. I think they suck. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys carry picture ID? Uh, yeah. You mind if I see your picture ID? You want to see my picture ID on me right now? Why is that? Because it, otherwise, I think I could come up with this uniform. You but think you could? <laughs> yes, I could. Even carrying a concealed weapon outside your body? Well, you're not carrying yours concealed. Well, you're right, but I also have it permitted. Yeah. Hi, how you guys doing? You guys want to go through? Can we go that way? Yeah. Well, thank Street's you. closed. Go right ahead. One thing. I'm asking you a straight up question, no, no, and no, I, act I actually expect an answer. Yes. Nice. Good for you. Now my question: You have a picture ID on you. I do. Can I see it? I have my business card. No, I don't want a business card. I can make those too. You want to see my business card? Here's a good one. Are you John? That's me. I'm Jason. Nice to meet you, John. Check out the back. My question is, it sounds like you're refusing to show me your ID card. Maybe you have uh, some sort of rule, regulation, or policy that says you can't do that. My question is, to whom would you present your picture ID? You can keep that and read it later. No, I like, I like this stuff, John. This is cool. If you take a prisoner to a, to a building, to a, if you take a prisoner to Multnomah County Jail, do you have to show it there? No. Where, do you, if you have one, then why would you need one? Well, they want us, I mean, everybody should be carrying their driver's license with them, correct? Uh -huh. Everybody should have, the Bureau says that we need to carry our ID with us. Uh-huh. So. Do you have picture ID that says your DPSST number on it? Yeah. I do. Why My business card has that too, John. Why do they give you picture ID? So, like when I go in the courthouse, so I can show that to them too. So you can show it to them in the courthouse? Yeah. So you can carry your weapon or what? Well, yeah, so, I mean, so they know that I'm a police officer. I see. So you do show it to the county at the courthouse? Yes. Okay. To give testimony or whatever you Yes. Have. Okay. Where else? Is there any other place where you need Well, that? maybe if you go into a different uh, a business, if, uh, like, oh, to ride on the max and the trains, stuff like that. It's when you're undercover and stuff. So I work a lot of undercover stuff too, so we gotta carry all our stuff with us too. What's wrong, John? Okay. You know I am recording you, right? I got that now, yes. <laughs> okay. Now you're telling me you're undercover. No, not right now. Yeah. <laughs> what good does it do if you're undercover and you, we see you in uniform? I what guess I'm confused. Undercover, you mean you're in plain clothes? Plain clothes, yeah. Yeah, that's not necessarily undercover. Okay, well, what's your definition of undercover? That means when you don't want to identify yourself to anybody. Oh, no, no, when I'm working, yeah, I have my stuff, yeah. Okay. So, you use it for TriMap? Well, when we were riding, yes. When we were, like, following bad guys and stuff like that, yeah. Okay. Here's the reason why, because I tried to identify one of your officers in a video and I was told that they don't have to give me that information because they don't have that information. Well it depends on the situation John. I mean if we're undercover and we're working a case. No the man in question was in a video where he's using excessive force 
on a guy who has mental and emotional problems. Uh, well, I, I don't know, John. I wasn't there. Right. So that, I, I don't know. I don't know the situation. Right. But here's my point. You've just made my case. When I go back again to the district attorney, and you told me they issued you a, a an ID for a purpose other than in-house, which means it is public record. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, John.